What's up everybody? In today's video, I'm going to show you how to bypass your iCloud Lock iOS 12.4.7 device using the Sliver Tool version 4.4. .4. So without much ado, let's proceed and start. So first off, you need to download the Sliver Tool 4.4. .4. I'm also going to provide a link on the video description below. And then you just have to install it. And once you have it, you just have to copy the file in your applications folder. So again guys, it only works if it's on the applications folder. So in my case, I've already done that. So I just need to open it. And here it is. You go to more options. And then you can see here bypass iOS 12.4.7, which is now available for this version of this liver tool. So let me go ahead. Let me close that for in the meantime. So let me show my iPad, which is also on the activation screen. So there you go. It's showing it has an iCloud lock or an Apple ID attached to it. So let's go ahead and bypass this. So first thing is we need to jailbreak. So we need to open CheckRain 10.2. Here it is. So we have check crane. We're going to launch it. And then it says it's connected. iPad mini 2 cellular 12.4.7 connected in normal mode. So for this to work, I need to click the verbose mode. And then hit start. Next. And then it's entering recovery mode. So now once we are on recovery mode, we're going to prepare for the DFU. So there you go, Chakrin says it's waiting for me to start. So before you start, make sure that you're ready and make sure that your power button and your home button are actually working. So let's click start now and go into DFU. Holding the power in the home. Releasing the power button. And we're in DFU. So we're just gonna release it and then let it do its magic. So it's booting up. So it's running the codes and injecting the exploit. Uploading Bootstrap and then we're done. Okay, let's just gonna put the iPad down okay so it says here that we're done now we're done with check range so let's close that and now we're going to our sliver tool so back to our sliver tool oh there you go iPad if um, I if your iTunes would launch just close it so here we are back on the sliver tool version 4.4. We're now going to click the bypass and see what happens to the iPad. So first it says relay device info. It says got it and click make it drain. So you just have to give it a couple of seconds for it to actually work. So as you can see it's still running and making its exploit somewhere in the background. We're just gonna have to give it some time and wait. Let's try again, unable to activate. So it says here guys, read this message, it says connect to iTunes and connect without Wi-Fi to bypass. So we're gonna have to turn off the Wi-Fi and make it forget. Okay, and then connect to iTunes. Continue. And 
connect to iTunes again. Let's do that one more time. I'm just waiting for it to finish guys. This is the second try and attempt because it didn't seem to work on the first. Okay. Let's do that again. Start over into iTunes, continue. Now, let's try that one more time. I'm just going to hide the password that I'm typing in. So it says activating your iPad. Try again. Tuning your iPad again. Okay. Let's try again. Try again. Okay, this is getting difficult, <laughs> but let's not give up. It seemed to work on the Windows version, so this should also work. Let's try that one more time. Boom, and there you go guys, we just bypass. And then it's asking us to create a passcode, we're just gonna use 000, use anyway, and 000, and then get started. All right, so there you go guys, we successfully bypassed the iCloud lock device. So I hope you've learned from this video. And before we end this, let me show you that it's on iOS 12.4.7. Let's go to general, about, and there you go, guys. You can see here that it's actually on the iCloud iOS 12.4.7, iPad mini 2. And also you can see here that we have that check rain installed. And we're actually ready to install Cydia. So you know what to do guys when you have Cydia. Unfortunately, currently this is a tether jailbreak. So every time you restart your phone, this will have to be repeated. So that's it everybody. See you on the next video.